Hey guys, BioLizard1 here, and today I'm gonna bring you a never used match, and this is a never used match against Xo Joseph. This is a guy I actually met a few years ago, and yeah, we had a good time, we are good friends, and we battle occasionally, so this is the result of our never used action. I'm gonna use my never used team that I've used in all of my never used battles so far, and he's gonna use quite a balanced never used team uh, with some good Pokemon, such as Regigigas, that I used to use when uh, in Black and 4 generation. So, he's gonna start off with that Regigigas right, straight off the bat. I'm not really sure that most of Regigigas do is like Thunder Wave, Substitute, and then uh, uh, Confuse Rayu. But uh, luckily, I'm, I'm carrying my, uh, gl my Goliath is um, immune to that Thunder Wave. And I'm just gonna set up my Stealth Rocks, and then I'm gonna Volt Switch out of here, because I obviously don't wanna go up against this Goliath. And he's gonna switch out into his Grand Ball, and I know that Grand Ball is pretty much useless when you intimidate him, so my plan is just to Volt Switch out, go into my Ditto who has Transform, and I'm just gonna copy that Intimidate ability, and I'm gonna cut his attack with one stage, meaning that he won't be able to hurt me that much. And uh, that's what I'm just gonna do, I'm gonna go into my Ditto, Ditto is gonna copy his ability, intimidate him, and now I know he's pretty much rendered useless. Now he probably thinks he's gonna be able to go for a close combat on me, but I actually carry the choice scarf, so I'm just gonna go for that close combat and finish off his grand ball. Um, and I'm actually glad I got rid of that, because I don't really have a physical wall on this team, so I'm really glad that I already rid of that Pokemon. Now he's gonna switch out into Banette. I'm not really sure what this Banette is gonna do, so what I'm gonna do is just switch into Swallow and U turn out to get some damage on him. Maybe he was going to Sucker Punch me or something. Um, so he's gonna twist the dimension using Trick Room and that's obviously not good. Now I think he's gonna go for some kind of stab move, not sure what the normal move set of Banat is, but he's actually gonna go for a Destiny Bond, which means that he's gonna fear my Swallow, and I'm gonna go for a Brave Bird. Brave Bird is obviously going to finish him off, but due to Destiny Bond he's gonna take with me his, he's gonna take with him my uh, Swallow, so that's not really good. But uh, I'm glad that Banette is out of the way and that Trick Room is out of the way as well. He's gonna switch out into that Ampharos, and I'm gonna switch out into my um, into my Cacturn. I'm just just gonna predict him to go for uh, a, 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 an Electric type move, so that's why I switched out into my Probo Pass. Probo Pass is gonna go for an Earth Power. It's gonna be Step, and I thought it would do slightly more damage. And he's gonna keep going for that Focus Blast, so I'm thinking, hmm, this guy's probably choice specs. So I'm gonna be able to uh, let my uh, Probe Pass die and switch into something that is immune to the Fighting type move. And that Pokemon I have on my team, it is my Golurk, so I'm pretty much fine with it. But then he reveals to me that he has Hidden Power, which is probably Hidden Power Ice. And that tells me this guy is probably Expert Belted, and I'm not really sure if I can leave that Hidden Power Ice coming into my direction. And I'm just gonna go for an Earthquake after I live it, so kinda strange that I did live it. So, not really sure what this moveset is, he might have Lumberry as well with Rest maybe. Uh, but yeah, like I said, I'm not really sure what this guy packs. Now he's gonna switch out into his uh, in, into his Pillow Swine. I always wanna say Mammo Swine when I see this guy. But he's actually gonna switch uh, so into his Pillow Swine. I'm gonna switch out, go into my Samurott. Samurott is going to be able to take any move that this guy throws at me, especially since he's having a Violite. I'm pretty sure that he's not going to be able to lay a hand on me. He's gonna go Toxic after I went for a Substitute, so I'm gonna dodge that really nicely. Now I'm gonna go for a Surf, and he's not gonna like that, even though he does carry the Violite. It's gonna be super effective, and it's gonna do a good chunk of damage to him. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna go for surf straight off the bat right now. No, I'm gonna go for a substitute first because I wanna be at a range where a next attack coming from any of his Pokemon is gonna bring me down to a torrent range. So um, he's gonna go for another earthquake um, and now I'm gonna go for a surf knowing that it's gonna be able to take him down. And uh, yeah, that's. I'm kinda glad that I got this pile of swine out of my way. Now he's gonna switch out into I see you. And that is actually his um, his executor. I'm gonna go for a substitute right here. I'm gonna get my select berry boosted, which is just perfect for me um, because now I'm gonna be able to. Um, yeah, I was going to be able to outspeed him anyway, but if I manage to finish him off with Ice Beam, I'm gonna be able to sweep the rest of his team. So, um, and I'm gonna get some life orb damage because I went for that substitute, which is always nice. 
Um, and after I went for that Ice Beam, I see that he's gonna need one more move, one more Psychic to take out my Samurath, but because of the life or damage, he's gonna lose his Exeggutor as well. And at this point, Exeggutor was kind of threatening my team a little bit, he could have swept through it maybe, but uh, I'm glad Samurath handled that for me. Now I'm gonna switch out into my Golurk while he is gonna switch out into his Goliath, and that is his last Pokemon actually. He may, may have a sm slim chance of winning, at but that's what he's thinking probably, but I'm actually Choice Bandit Iron Fist and I'm just gonna go for that Drain Punch and that is just gonna finish him off in two hits, so it's gonna be super effective damage, I'm gonna get some health back, he's gonna knock off my Choice Band, not that it's gonna matter because the next move is gonna finish him off, um, and yeah, that is gonna be the game. Uh, he's gonna flee here, so that was the game. I hope you guys enjoyed this battle. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Um, you can vote for the most valuable Pokemon of my team. In my opinion, it was Samurai because it did a great job. You can post for your MVP in the comment section below. Um, you, yeah, I'm gonna pick one of you viewers and I'm gonna give you the Pokemon you voted for. So be sure to leave a comment to this video and be sure to check your PM on a regular basis because I'm gonna contact you through it. Anyway, this was the match, this was the game, I hope you guys enjoyed, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe and see you in my next battle.